We have had decades of running the experiment of when somebody is in pain, let's get them out of it as fast as possible. Let's help them with medication. Let's talk to them about positive psychology. Let's have them look on the bright side. Let's make like all of their friends and family members try to make them feel happy again. That way of looking at the hard parts of being human has given us rising rates of suicidality, an exploding drug epidemic. We've got, even before the pandemic, loneliness was considered a bigger public health risk than smoking. People are lonely because they can't say what's real for them without being corrected. If I'm trying to feel connected with you and every time I tell you that I'm having a rough day or that I'm feeling really sad, you tell me to look on the bright side and maybe I should go for a run to get some endorphins. That doesn't help me feel better. It tells me that I can't come to you with what's true. And that's going to make me feel isolated and alone. So if we have epidemics of suicidality and depression and interpersonal violence and loneliness, well, then maybe we need to look at what the f we're doing when people are in pain, because telling them they shouldn't be in pain is not working.